Welcome to Wisdom Trek with Gramps. I am Guthrie Chamberlain, and we are on day 2,225 of our trek. The purpose of Wisdom Trek is to create a legacy of wisdom, to seek out discernment and insights, and to boldly grow where few have chosen to grow before. In today's Wisdom Nuggets, I'm thrilled to continue our journey through the book of Proverbs as we uncovered this timeless wisdom. Today we are delving into Proverbs chapter 12, verses 15 through 21 from the New Living Translation. So let's lace up our hiking boots as we explore the powerful words and the contrast between wisdom and folly in these verses. In Proverbs chapter 12, verses 15 through 21, we continue our exploration of the characteristics and the outcomes of living a life of wisdom. These verses provide valuable insights into the significance of our words and the stark contrast between wisdom and folly. Verse 15, Fools think their own way is right, but the wise listen to others. This verse lays the foundation for the passage, highlighting the stark contrast between the attitudes of fools and the wisdom of the wise. Fools insist their way is right, while the wise have the humility to listen to others. It's a powerful reminder of the value of open-mindedness. Verse 16. A fool is quick-tempered, but a wise person stays calm when insulted. These verses focus on emotional control and resilience. A fool easily loses their temper, but a wise person remains calm even when insulted. It underlines the importance of emotional intelligence and self-control. Verse 17. An honest witness tells the truth. A false witness tells lies. Here we encounter the contrast between honesty and deception. An honest witness speaks the truth, while a false witness spreads lies. It emphasizes the value of integrity and truthfulness. Verse 18. Some people make cutting remarks, but the words of the wise brings healing. These verses highlight the impact of words on others. Some people make hurtful remarks, but the words of the wise bring healing. It reminds us to use the power of our words to build up instead of tearing down. Verse 19. Truthful words stand the test of time, but lies are soon exposed. This verse underscores the enduring value of truthful words. They stand the test of time while lies inevitably are exposed. It reinforces the importance of honesty and transparency in everything that we do. Verse 20. Deceit fills hearts that are plotting evil. Joy fills hearts that are planning peace. This verse focuses on the intentions of our heart. Hearts filled with deceit plot evil, while those who are planning peace are filled with joy. It emphasizes the importance of our intentions and their impact on our lives and relationships. Verse 21, no harm comes to the godly, but the wicked have their fill of trouble. These verses contrast the destinies between the godly and the wicked. The godly are spared from harm, while the wicked find themselves in a constant state of trouble. It underscores the enduring value of living a righteous life. As we reflect on Proverbs chapter 12, verses 15 through 21, we are reminded that wisdom isn't just theoretical knowledge. It's practical and influences choices we make in our daily lives. So let's take a moment to consider these questions. How can you cultivate open-mindedness and the willingness to listen to others? In what ways can you use your words to bring healing and build up those around you? Remember, wisdom equips us to make the choices that lead to a life of purpose and fulfillment. So let's summarize the key takeaways from Proverbs chapter 12, verses 15 through 21. The first one is open-mindedness. Fools insist on their way, while the wise listen to others. Second, emotional control. A fool is quick-tempered, but the wise person remains calm even when insulted. Third is integrity. An honest witness tells the truth, while false witnesses spread lies. Fourth, the impact of words. The words of the wise bring healing, while cutting remarks will hurt. Next is fifth, enduring value of truth. Truthful words stand the test of time, while lies are soon exposed. Sixth, intention and impact. Hearts filled with deceit will plot evil, while planning peace brings us joy. And seventh, contrasting destinies. The godly are spared from harm, while the wicked face constant trouble. In closing, remember that wisdom equips us to make the choice in life that leads to fulfillment. As we continue our journey through this vast landscape of wisdom, may we embrace open-mindedness, honesty, and the power of our words, 
and then choose a path that leads to a life of purpose and blessings. Thank you for joining me on this leg of our wisdom track. I hope that these verses have inspired you to embrace the power of words and make choices that lead to a life of purpose and fulfillment. As we continue on our journey, may we navigate life's challenges with wisdom and grace. And if you found this podcast insightful, please subscribe and leave us a review. Then encourage your friends and family to join us and come along with us tomorrow for another day of Wisdom Trek, Creating a Legacy. And thank you so much for allowing me to be your guide, your mentor, but most importantly, I am your friend as I serve you through the Wisdom Trek Podcast and Journal. And as we take this trek of life together, let us always live abundantly, love unconditionally, listen intentionally, learn continuously, lend to others generously, lead with integrity, and leave a living legacy each day. I am Guthrie Chamberlain, reminding you to keep moving forward, enjoy your journey, and create a great day every day. See you next time for more Daily Wisdom.